Hey, what's up guys? Today I want to talk about Arts Ad. They are a print on demand production partner with the biggest catalog of customizable products that we can add to our print on demand shops that I've ever seen. And getting started and using them, it's quick, it's free, it's easy, and again, I'm gonna blow your minds with some of these products that we are gonna be able to customize and add and sell online. By the way, like I've said this before, but whenever you get out in front of a trend or you've got a design that's a bestseller and moving you know, multiple units a day, that's when you want to expand all the product types that you are making it available for sale on. And that is where Arts Ad comes into play by allowing us to really expand our offerings. And you guessed it, just like it says in the name, all you have to do is add your art. So I'm gonna tell you everything you need to know about this company, how to use them, how to get started. So let's get into it. Real quick reminder, take advantage of the free weekly print-on-demand giveaway. The link is at the top of the description and it only takes like 10 seconds to enter. Also, I've got an eight-day print-on-demand mini course down there to help you launch your Etsy shop that you can then integrate with Arts Ad and get started making money online. Passive income, by the way, because Arts Ad's gonna fulfill all your orders and ship them out to your customer for you. So make sure you take advantage of that. It's completely free. And I've got a great print-on-demand Facebook group that you should join if you are not in there already. All right, so we are talking about print on demand production partner Arts Ad and their website. You can see a screenshot here behind me. I've got a link in the description and I'm going to tell you a little bit about them in this video. But the need to know is that they are a production partner. What I just said is basically summing it up. We lean on them to do the things that would take us forever to do that we don't have the infrastructure to do. Like if we sell a print on demand t-shirt, well, if we don't have the ability to print that design onto that t-shirt and then go ship it out to our customer, which is very time intensive, uh, well, we farm the workout to a company like Artsed. By the way, that's why we also look at companies that have integrations with the major e-commerce platforms. That way, when we make sales, the sales are automatically detected and all of these um, processes are kicked off without us having to manually do anything, which allows us to focus on scaling our business which is how we really get to that next level where we're making the type of money that we really want to make, not just, you know, a couple sales here and there, but uh, the more time and effort you get to focus on like niche research and monitoring trends and running ads and doing marketing, uh, the more money you're going to make in the long run. So that's why we always want to be on top of our production partners. By the way, you can use multiple production partners too. So you don't just have to use one you can use uh, complementary production partners as well. It's also great to have some that can function as backups to your other production partners in case something goes out of stock and whatnot. So um, it's worth you know having a backup and Arts Ad should be up there as a primary option. So like I said, it is 100% free to use. I just wanna make that clear because sometimes uh, you know there are various out production partners out there that do charge you uh, in order to really use them. So as far as locations go, they have three factories around the world. They have one in Australia, one in the United States, and one in China. Here's some additional information about their factories. So they have large facilities that combined house more than 300,000 square feet of production space. As far as capacity goes, they're capable of supplying 9,000 customized items per day and 20,000 items during peak season, which we know is important. If you've ever sold print on demand during the fourth quarter, you know that uh, you need the high production capacity. Otherwise, what happens to our orders? Well, they get delayed and that causes problems for everybody. Uh, as far as their printers go, they utilize highly specialized printers, including the Cornet Storm uh, Epson printers, the Muto VJ 1924 and the Roland FH 740. So highly specialized, highly expensive printers to produce our products. They have over 500 print-on-demand products for us to choose from. Here are some new arrivals as of me prepping this video. And you can see here they've got like dresses, uh, night robes, skater dress, expansion dress. I mean, this is kind of out of my wheelhouse. Uh, and they've got like a high-waisted bikini set. All right, so they've got stuff that I never thought would be customizable as print-on-demand products. But let's just say you want to do like a print-on-demand uh, swimsuit company. Well, Arts Ad has everything you need. You don't have to look multiple places. You can literally just work with them and you're already in good shape. Uh, they have shoes and this is not all the shoes they have, by the way. Like this was just the new arrivals that I saw when I was setting up this video. This is just a glimpse into the shoes that you're able to customize through Arts Ad. I'm actually going to show you how to set up custom shoes in this video, but 
a lot of great options right here, right away. I mean, the running shoes, for instance, look cool to me. Um, typically, you'll see when you see print on demand shoes, you see something similar to what you've got behind me with the high tops, but they've even got like boots. So, yeah, just really cool. Uh, customizable bags, backpacks, uh, travel bags, tote bags shoulder bags um just lots of options i've even got right here i'm going to show you a um, a better sample review yeah you can tell why i said better by the way because the green screen does not like it when i show green products but uh, they sent me a few products uh samples so i'm going to show you a fanny pack that we did an all over print on speaking of all over print lots of options for all over print products again these are only five options but there are many more than five you can see bomber jackets sweatpants uh, leggings, yoga leggings, hoodies, um, decorations, those canvas prints, by the way, uh, great pairing. Like if you're going to, you, you've, if you're subscribed, you've seen me talk about selling digital downloads on Etsy. Well, my designs is working, expanding on their functionality, um, doing crazy stuff. But I know one of the things they've got in the works is allowing you to basically create digital downloads for canvas print sets specifically so let's say you sell the digital download for canvas prints and then you say oh by the way for an extra fee maybe it's like 50 bucks or whatever it is 100 bucks i'll actually send you the canvas print sets as well in addition to you having the digital download like how cool is that that you can pair the two together but then you're like oh crap who's going to actually fulfill the order oh there you go arts ad will easy posters doormats tablecloths etc and additional accessories, customizable watches, clocks, uh, mugs, umbrellas. I mean, they've got everything, guys. Like umbrellas, really? Umbrellas? I mean, I'm just saying, that's amazing. I haven't seen anybody selling these print-on-demand customizable umbrellas to date. And then I see Arts Ad, and I'm like, oh, crap, they they literally do everything. So uh, maybe you'll be the only person on the internet selling print-on-demand umbrellas, so go out there and do it, you know? All right, so as far as their integrations go, you can integrate with Shopify, WooCommerce, Etsy, you know I'm a fan of that, Amazon, you know I'm a big fan of that, and Wix, all right, so I'm, you know, when you start your own website, there's no shame in that, it's just you got to come up with the traffic, but if you want to go and carve out a piece of traffic or a piece of internet real estate on the heavily trafficked e-commerce destinations uh, like Etsy and Amazon, two of my favorite, well, Artsad has integrations for both. And if you're not selling on any of those aforementioned platforms or you have an additional website, well, they do also offer API integrations so you can still streamline the order fulfillment, but you're either gonna have to be a developer or hire a developer in order to get those established. But once they're established, they're done. They continue to work. And again, it's automated, it's streamlined, and you can focus on scaling your business. I'm not sure if the Amazon one is completely live, by the way. I think it may be in the works because the Amazon integration is quite rare, but if it's not live right now, it will be, all right? So as far as customizing print-on-demand products goes, let me show you how easily we can do it. They just updated their product customizer, uh, the wizard, you know, the process, so it's very easy to do. Uh, I went ahead and I, like I mentioned earlier, we're gonna customize these men's high top shoes that I know you can sell some. I mean, you gotta figure out what the trending niche is or the design, obviously, uh, but I know that these sell well. All right, I've seen Shopify stores dedicated to only selling custom print on demand shoes. And uh, you can, when you get a good, you know, niche audience and you find things they like, you can make quite a bit of money. Cause I know you can charge, you know, 70, 80, 90 bucks. You can see the base cost there, $33. So here you go, when you click, by the way, all you have to do is click new custom lab. When you click that, it launches their wizard. This is what the wizard looks like. Uh, this is the default view, by the way. So all you have to do is just click to upload your image in the top left corner up there. I went ahead and I used that Bitcoin design that I had used from uh, Vexels. I've used it a couple times in the past, but I like this design. I don't know what to say, I just like it. Uh, although the one thing, <laughs> the downside of it is of course, it does not show up on the green screen at all. I was actually wearing a shirt that they sent me and then I was like, ah, I'm gonna take it off for the video because it makes me look like a ghost because you can see right through me. Um, so here we go. I uploaded my design. It automatically, oh, I didn't use the Bitcoin one. Never mind. All right, I used the donut one for this video, <laughs> the, uh, the neon donuts. All right, so we switched it up today. Uh, I uploaded that design. You can see here that it basically allow, it, it automatically snaps the design to the size of the product as you see there and then in the top right corner which i didn't include in this screenshot but it would be like right above my head here if i didn't crop it out uh, it shows you previews so in this case the product is available the shoes the high top shoes are available in white they're available in black and you can see both um, they do mock-ups in real time for you so i mean 
you basically have your finished product mock-up. We know that they don't actually exist until after the product is printed, but I mean, check out the quality of those mock-ups. They look really nice. Like you could do a lot of real internet marketing with mock-ups like that. So, I mean, I'm excited. Uh, and you can customize them very easily. So I went ahead and played around with the text tool that's built into their wizard. Remember the wizard up here? Uh, if you look at the left-hand side there, underneath color, it says text. So I went ahead and I used the text tool and just added the, the text Ryan's shoes. Not because I necessarily think it looks amazing, but more or less just to show you that, hey, if you want to sell like these on Etsy and enable personalization, which is a great way of standing out, hey, very easy to do so and just utilize the text tool. You don't have to like go in and create some new design in Photoshop or Illustrator. You can just go ahead and do it right there in the app. Artsad also has a batch design functionality where you can select a product type, upload multiple images, and have them mocked up and essentially created all at once. And then you can do a batch synchronization with your shop. So that's really cool. That's functionality I've never seen anywhere else. And I'm really excited to try it from Artsad. All right, as far as product samples go, uh, I went ahead and got a fanny pack with the Bitcoin design and I got a Hawaiian shirt. So as you can see here, fanny pack, very high quality. They come in nice little bags as well. So you feel like you're getting a truly like quality product uh, and over here the Hawaiian shirt you can see that it's quite comfortable by the way uh, now I typically wear more fitted clothing but that's besides the point this is just to show you kind of the um, print quality and the overall product quality here that we ended up receiving when we got these samples so I mean I'm definitely a fan of the um, two products that I received the product samples and you know there's a huge catalog so I mean, you can definitely, by the way, they'll discount you if you want to order product samples. So you just have to reach out. They do have a live chat function, makes it very easy to get in touch with somebody that works at Artsad. Uh, so yeah, if you're, you know, like me and you want to do sample orders to make sure that your products are high quality, go ahead and do that. By the way, they offer products made in the USA. So that's definitely, if you guys haven't tried selling things made in the USA, give it a shot. Again, like I said, when you have a trending design or a trending niche, that's the best time to add new products to your store because they're already validated. Like when you see sales starting to roll in, okay, you've got a validated idea here. Expand your offerings, expand your catalog. Made in the USA is a great way of standing out. I know firsthand that people will pay a little bit extra for that because I mean, I sell made in the USA products. I'm not going to lie. Like I, I don't want to give away like everything that, I, you know, if you're on my print on demand course, maybe I'll give you away everything, but you know, to YouTube, I'm giving away enough in saying that I do offer some products that are made in the USA. I do charge more because the base cost of anything made in the USA is going to be higher than if it's made overseas. That doesn't mean that you can't make sales though. You pass that price along to the consumer and there are, you know, again, if they don't want to buy it from you because it's too expensive, they, they won't. Right. But you don't, you don't have to only offer stuff on products that are made in the USA. Although whatever niche you're selling, it may make sense to like, we've got, um, you know, July 4th coming up. We got Memorial day coming up. Those are the types of holidays where made in USA, if you're going to sell those types of niche designs, it may make sense. So they have a pretty wide catalog. Again, I just screenshotted a few options. You can see socks, you can see different types of mugs, you can see canvas prints, you can see t-shirts. So just know that these are an option in your store and don't, you know, you may think, oh, it's too expensive for me to make money on. Don't knock it until you try it. Okay. Cause I'm, I promise you just mark it up as much as you need to. Make sure you display in the listing made in the USA. Like on Etsy, if I'm selling something made in the USA, I always put a big sticker like on the, the primary thumbnail that has an American flag that says made in the USA. So people know, even if they're scrolling in search results, they've got a hundred options. When they see mine, they know, oh, that one's made in the USA. Uh, they have a rebate system for any drop shippers and resellers. Basically, uh, you get better rates on products. You get also some cash back depending on how many units you move. So um, that's not really me, but hey, that's, you know, that's there. They also make it extremely easy to open up your own arts ad hosted store. And as you guys know, I always preach to occupy as much online real estate as possible. So this is a no brainer. It's an additional way of generating additional sales and you earn a 5% royalty on the sales that come through. Uh, you can find your store link there on your dashboard. So make sure to go out and promote it and bring people to your store. They've also got a live chat system so that you can work with somebody there that can help you in real time instead of emailing them and waiting for a response and you kind of lose momentum for whatever you're working on. Uh, the live chat system's always nice and that's just integrated on their website in the bottom right corner. So 
All right, guys, that's it. Check out Artsad. The link is at the top of the description. Also, in the description, if you're like, Ryan, I'm excited to use them, but how am I going to make sales or how do I get started on Etsy or on Amazon or elsewhere? How do I do design? How do I do niche research? Well, I have a full course showing you everything I know, how I make six-figure sales every single year selling print-on-demand products. Check out my course. The link is in the description. You can find out more there, and you can always email me if you have any questions. All right, guys, thank you for watching. Please hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. Go check out ArtsEd, and I will see you tomorrow with a new video.